The VFXW is the end result of four years of research and development on how we can improve our existing off-road motorcycle helmets. It's packed full of features that are really kind of unique and some new technologies had to be developed to bring you guys this new helmet. We began uh, working with focus groups and talking to our professional riders as well as magazine editors to see what customers and riders demanded from an off-road motorcycle helmet. I like the, the changes that they made and I think they were definitely in the right direction and they're that willing to, to take our feedback and, and uh, really take it and use it. Joey's Snell approved motorcycle helmets are made with our AIM Plus shell construction. AIM Plus shell construction combines layers of fiberglass with organic and special high performance organic materials. We combine all these materials together to give us the absolute best level of shell construction and lightweight that we can provide for our customers. Um, just, just having the show, I have so much more confidence and, and so much more belief in the helmet and, and what it does. And, and they have so much testing and so much background and they've been around for so long that you know it's, it's kind of hard not to have confidence in the helmet. Once I wore it and uh, you know did some laps on it, I could tell that the, you know, the ventilation on the helmet had uh, been improved on it. Rather than worrying about uh, you know, having plastic vent covers and things like that to be able to close it off, we just went ahead and opened it up to maximize airflow through the helmet. I think that with the new pads and the ventilation, it's just another step that they made that's, that's in the right direction. You know, I've done some long testing on it, and I've never, never got goggle drip or you know, nothing like that, never been too sweaty. Between, uh, between the new material that the, the, uh, the foam is made out of and uh, you know, the new ventilation, it seems like my head is you know, quite a bit cooler. Our 3D Max Dry Liner system features contoured foam in different densities that allow us to provide a soft feel as well as a firm hold. Our Max Dry material is capable of absorbing and dissipating sweat twice as fast as a conventional nylon interior. A couple of years ago, one of our riders in Supercross uh, had a clutch lever enter the mouthpiece area of his helmet and it cut his lip. So Shoei engineers kind of went to work right away trying to figure out how to solve that problem. We went ahead and we installed a, uh, a stainless steel mesh screen behind our cross mouthpiece. Then behind that, we have a uh, strip of our AIM Plus shell material that strengthens that, uh, that stainless steel mesh. That helps prevent uh, foreign objects from entering the mouthpiece area of the helmet. Another feature that, uh, that we worked really hard to perfect on this helmet is the visor. Originally we had a shorter visor uh, just for appearance sake. Ricky told us that we needed to have a longer visor for additional protection from roost in the sun and our engineers on the spot uh, increased the length of the visor and had him test it to determine the proper length. So I think uh... I think I helped a little bit on uh, improving the visor, you know, it's got just a, it's just a little bit longer now. Once we got that down, we tested with Trey Kennard, who told us that we needed a greater range of adjustability because uh, in outdoor motocross, he wanted to be able to lower the visor down for roost protection, but for supercross, he wanted to be able to lift it completely up and out of his line of sight so that he had maximum visibility for night racing. The VFXW comes equipped with a dual layer EPS liner. The inner EPS liner stiffness varies based on the size of the helmet. Smaller size helmets come equipped with a softer inner EPS liner that gives more easily since the weight of smaller riders tends to be lighter and the impact energies tend to be less. The larger size helmets come equipped with a, a stiffer inner EPS liner so they can absorb the larger energies generated by heavier riders. This technology allows showy engineers to fine tune the stiffness of the EPS liner based on the size of the helmet. Although not required by Snell or DOT, the entire chin bar of the VFXW is lined with the same impact absorbing EPS that protects the crown area of your head. The 
when I when I tested the prototype helmet, the, the first thought when I put it on was, wow, you know, it got better. Mm -hmm.